Hey everyone, I wasn't going to react to this to start with, but I'm sure a lot of you have heard about Nikocado Avocado before. He was known for his crazy mukbangs, his insane mental breakdowns during his videos, and his overweight status. He was bullied a lot, and he kind of became the internet's punching bag. Well, earlier, he uploaded a video called Two Steps Ahead, where he reveals something insanely shocking. Originally, I wasn't going to react to this, but I started watching it and I realized he discusses a lot of important things in this. And it's not just some gimmick. It's not just some act. And I feel like we would benefit by listening to him. So, without further ado, I'm going to let him take it away. Two steps ahead. I am always two steps ahead. This has been the girl greatest social experiment of my entire life. It's alluring, it's compelling, it's gripping to observe all these unwell, disoriented beings roam the internet in search of stories, ideas, rivalries, where they feel encouraged and engaged, where they involve themselves with the stories and become a product of influence. Thirsty for a distraction from time unspent, spoiling their minds, yet stimulating them at the same time. All right, I'm gonna pause right there. You might be wondering, what is happening? Well, outside of the super villain speech that he's giving, he's actually talking a lot about his journey in YouTube. And again, like I said, how, how the community has viewed him for his weight and his his actions and how that kind of drove him to be super famous but also affected his mental health in a way which he'll talk more about it's brilliant and it's dangerous i feel as if i'm monitoring ants on an ant farm one follows another follows another, follows another. It's mesmerizing. It's spellbinding. All these little consumers, all of these lost and bored people, people consuming anything that they're told to consume. So I am the villain. And there is the big reveal. This is, this is kind of crazy. All right, so this is the plot twist of the century. He basically lost 250 pounds over the last two years secretly. No one knew about this. He had a bunch of pre-recorded videos that he would upload for his community to still keep, keep that momentum going, keep everyone thinking that he's still doing what he's doing and he's, he's fat and he's, he's having these mental breakdowns on camera. And he's eating a bunch of food and he's just unhealthy. He had that, he held that perception up for, for the last two years when reality he was actually on this insane transformation grind, which I just have to respect so much. It takes a lot of hard work. It's way more hard work than you can even imagine. Like think about all the hard work it would take and multiply that by like four. And that's pretty much how hard it is to do something like this, especially in two years. This is the type of stuff that would take people many, many years to do. And doing it in just two years is very impressive. Now, right there, he was also talking about how, how the internet is a pretty awful place. <laughs> Which, if you guys don't believe me, just go to Instagram Reels and go to the comments and you'll get your answer. But yeah, the, the internet's an awful place and he's been sort of seeing all that unfold in, 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 in his life. And that's, that's kind of what has driven him to do something like this, which is, again, very impressive. Because I've made myself one. And you will continue to consume these stories about me year after year after year for as long as I tell the internet that I am the villain stories that permeate and linger and infect the minds of the ants influence the ants 
brainwash the ants. You are the ants. This guy's looking like Lex Luthor. He <laughs> he does have a point here. Like, uh, I mean, I, I'm, I'm not going to keep repeating the same thing. But yeah, we are ants, basically. And technology has sort of... Technology and the internet has sort of brainwashed a lot of people into not only, like, believing everything they see, but sort of just not really thinking about how their impact not really thinking about their impact on the internet. Like if you if you were to roast someone on the comments that you just type something, you move on with your day, right? But it's really just whoever reads that comment. The 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 video the guy who made the video reads that comment. The other people watching the video read that comment and they get fueled by that to sort of leave their own comment. And it's sort of this this sort of butterfly effect that that negativity can cause on the internet. And that's sort of what he's talking about and that's sort of what I I wanted to bring up. This is why I'm making this video, just because this is a pretty important topic to discuss, and uh, it's just you, you just gotta know what your actions are doing, and that's sort of what he's talking about. But I'm I'm not gonna we're not gonna watch this whole video. I just wanted to kind of briefly discuss this, but let's keep going. Today I woke up from a very long dream, and I also woke up having lost 250 pounds off of my body. Yet just yesterday, people were calling me fat and sick and boring and irrelevant. People. People are the most messed up creatures on the entire planet. And yet I've still managed to stay two steps ahead of everyone. The joke's on you. All right, yeah, that that's pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> That's pretty sick. Yeah, that this is really interesting. This is a very interesting plot twist of uh, him just for two years. But yeah, the rest of this video is still him just sort of monologuing, talking about his life and how it, he it, it felt like a bad dream the last couple years, and he he wasn't doing good mentally and physically and how he's been on this grind and he he does say he's not gonna quit doing mukbangs he's still gonna enjoy that he, he does one in this video as you can see but yeah definitely give it a watch I'm, I'm obviously i'm not watching the whole thing but definitely give it a watch in your free time it's very interesting a lot to learn about human nature and uh the grind looking forward i i, I actually want him to re-up start uploading more and more i would love to see him release a documentation of how he lost that much weight to see like his day-to-day -day, uh, diet and the workouts and all that sort of stuff and his lifestyle. Uh, that'd just be really cool to see actually just to, in the last, cause two years for 250 pounds is astronomical. This was sort of my thoughts and my discussion on this. Uh, go watch him, go subscribe to him uh, if you haven't already. Subscribe to me, please, subscribe. But yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, and let me know in the comments below what you want me to react to next, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!